Hello, my name is Nate. Welcome to my Fluid Art channel. I hope you can hear me. It's another dark and stormy night here in Costa Rica. The rainy season is definitely upon us. Um, and I am excited to be doing a uh, another Halloween collab with my friend Anuka from Anuka Fluid Art. Um, I have in mind to do a... Ooh, maybe it's letting up a little bit. I, I have in mind to do a, uh, a landscape uh, flip cup pour here in some dark and moody colors. Uh, it's gonna be a two part process. I'm gonna do uh, the flip cup landscape here, let it dry and then add uh, something to it at the end. And I'll show you that when I do. Um, I'm using, you can see that I have a previously used canvas here. Um, I like this when I did it. It was a, um, a, a, a rainbow open cup pour. Um, but sometimes paintings grow on you and sometimes they um, uh, become less favorite of yours. <laughs> so the, the more I look at this, the more I, I'm, I think I can do something better with this canvas. So I'm going to use this for this pour and uh, I'm going to dirty layer three uh, cups here. And uh, for the sky, I want it to be very uh, purple. So I'm using uh, a lot of leftover colors here. So this is um, a big mix of uh, I know that there's some Amsterdam uh, violet blue light in here, but there's a whole bunch of other purples and reds and blues, and, and there's some metallics in there that I can see. It might even be some uh, this little piggy pigments. Uh, so I'm going to start with that. Uh, for some depth, I'm going to add some dioxazine purple. Uh, for some highlights, I'm going to use some uh, deco art matte metallics ivory pearl and I'm gonna add in a little bit of black to that as well. So I'll be dirty layering two of these cups. It's gonna be primarily sky. And then one of the cups I will do uh, in some other colors, which are, uh, again, another kind of Franken mix of different uh, blues. It's kind of a, a, a beautiful blue-gray color and uh, it, it has some metallics in it also. Uh, this is uh, some leftover reds, um, browns, golds, that kind of thing. And then I actually have some Decor 24 karat gold and some uh, Chroma Acrylic Acrylic Essentials white for some accents to it. Um, if I have any of this leftover once I do my sky, I might add some of the pearl white in there as, as another one of those unifying elements. So I'll have black in, in the sky and the, uh, and the land. Um, and some pearl white. So that is my plan. I'm gonna go ahead and put some music on for you so you don't have to listen to this rain and thunder behind me. And uh, let's start having some fun. So many days is yet to come. Many times has come to pass Too many moments put aside Getting out alive Getting out alive Writing letters in the sand Lost to oceans gentle
So here is the wet result. Ooh, look at that dark and moody sky. I'm really happy with that. Um, one of the fun things about using leftover paints is you discover that they have ingredients you didn't even realize. That um, white definitely had some uh, satin enamels in it because look at all of the cool boulder cells and pearls that popped up. Really nice. I love this line right here. Almost looks like sedimentary rock. Beautiful. I love that. I love the way all of these cells that popped up stretched out. Almost looks like water there. I love that. And then the sky. Ooh, look how pretty. Okay. Love that purple in there. Ooh, wow. Okay. Let's see how this dries. And we'll move on to the next step. So here is the dry result of my spooky landscape. I'm pretty happy with this. I don't think it's my favorite thing I've ever done, but I'm, it, 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 it's pretty close to what I had envisioned. I'm really happy that I used that dark purple in the sky. Um, the, the way that those cells stretched out reminds me of an ocean, so I think this is more of a seascape than a landscape. Um, and because of this line of uh, cells that kind of come out this way, I placed my my little pumpkin moon here um, in that space so it looked like the, the um, uh, reflection from the moon going across the water there. But yeah, these details are beautiful. I love my moon. I, I balloon dipped this with some um, DecoArt ivory pearl and some uh, 24 karat gold, just those two. So it has a nice shimmer to it. I really like that. And some depth and dimension to it. Uh, the way that these, uh, the clouds here uh, stretched out is really nice. Kind of some choppy water in the, in the ocean, which is nice. And then the uh, rocky beach area. I think that's nice too. Yeah, overall, I think I'm really happy with this. I let me know what you think in the comments. And thanks again, Anuka, for collaborating with me. And uh, if you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up. If you'd like to subscribe, now's a good time to do that. <laughs> and go mix up some paints and be fearless.